Ah, oh, hello everybody. It is Tuesday, November. November 1st, 2022. I'm Bryce Castillo, your pre-show green room escort and bringing you in and out of all of uh, the great stuff. Thank you so much for joining us here. We got a great night for you coming up. Coming up, we got a game. We got the Would You Rather bot back in action. Let's get a lot of stories from Halloween, which was a great time, I'm, I'm told, uh, and all sorts of great stuff. Oh my God, I got to find that clip. I got a clip I want to show everybody. Thank you everybody for joining us. Of course, patreon.com slash great night. Let's take it over to the green room. Green room, can you hear me? Hello, hello. Yo. Green room. Hi. Yeah. Have a green room. Is the, uh, is the clip the one that I hope it is from your friend of mine, ICU, world champion? No, I think that's the NASCAR the one he wants to show us. The one I had a set up that we talked yeah, about. No, the what, the yeah, the other one we talked oh, about. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Don't sound so right. disappointed. It's just content for the show. Wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> Uh, oh, uh, 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 oh! Which uh, what, uh, what? What is the? Mo- <laughs> oh. uh, so so when would you use this? What, whatever the, whatever this is. Hold on. We explain see, explain we to me. Because he said, "Don't sound so disappointed." Right. So we were showing him how not disappointed we could sound, but with the same O tone. Okay. Yeah, we could raise the pitch. Uh, see, uh, raise the, the pitch. It's out of my range. We keep talking about this. I I only can make it disappointed so high, and then uh, but 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 I I my has your voice gotten lower as you've aged? Yes. How much lower? To my nuts. <laughs> Speaking of nuts. Uh, watched a pair uh, that I didn't need to because HBO Max fed me episode one of season one, not episode one of season two. So I saw of some White testicles. Lotus. Yeah. Of White Lotus. Did yeah. you wind up watching the first episode of season two? I watched all of episode one of season one and then found out together. That was not. You the, and I. Yeah. Because I was talking about all the great Sicily shots. And, and I was like. like Wait a minute, Why Sicily, that ever... place where they put a lay on your neck and they blow <laughs> into a conch shell? <laughs> yep. Uh, uh, yes, I did. I did watch uh, episode one of season two. Looked good. Looked as good. In fact, it, it actually led to a conceit we're going to do on Cord Killers where I'm going to watch both episodes. Oh, what? Week by week? Season one and season two. Oh, that's pretty rad. Because, uh, because, because I accidentally watched episode one of season one, uh, I was able to see all the things that tracked one for one, you know, the hand waving and the the uh, uh, character of of the person in charge of the White Lotus. Yeah. So in the in the first season, you have somebody who's whinging and giving all this contradictory advice, you know, and and like it's, it ends up being terrible advice. Uh, and in this case, you have somebody who's the, the exact inverse, where it's like, did you have a hard time on the flight? Oh, I only ask because you're very old. old yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I'm into it. I'm, I'm excited. Uh, kind of disappointed that I have to bother to care about a murder at some point. You'll care. Okay. You'll care. Because it's like, imagine that it's like it's nominally a whodunit only because... These people are going to get into the messiest, sloppiest fucking like interactions between each other. Right. And like to the point where eventually it's like, all right, either somebody's going to snap and murder somebody or there's going to be an accident, both of which are fully fucking in play considering how sloppy and messy everybody is. So what's wild is you have at least a sense about what the rules are because you've seen the first season. Yeah. Whereas I don't know if it's, is this the kind of murder where somebody had a motivation like you slighted me in the high school yearbook and I finally got my revenge? Or is it, you know, you earlier this season upset me and so I killed you? I will say that you correctly have deduced it's not about the murder. Right. It's about... Who it's about is rich dead. people. It's about who's dead. And, and status. And and well, and really you're only gonna care about that more as you see all of them interact with each other and you make your decisions on like, okay, well, this person's kind of an asshole, this person's kind of out of control. I don't think you ever really wish anybody dead. There's nobody who's like mustache twirling enough to be like, oh well, fuck him. He should die. Right. Uh but there are certain moments where it's like, ooh, you're sloppy. Oh, you're 
you're out of your lane. Like, like you're doing shit that fucking could could uh, uh, end bad for you. I love I love farting grandpa who's flirty as fuck. F. Murray Abraham. <laughs> oh yeah, fucking amazing. Uh, Holy shit, right? Well, and and why hasn't he been on, been on television in two decades? Uh, what was the last thing I would have seen him in? I don't know. I just know his name. Yeah. He's got one of the, his, uh, uh, like, Lyndon Baines Johnson. Yep, one of like those. Like that. Classic television names. actor, Lyndon it Baines Johnson. sticks in your head. Yeah. You can't help it. Uh, uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm convinced that, uh, that the fact that you have this uh, grandfather, son, grandson thing, uh, I'm convinced that, this, uh, that the grandpa is all talk and flirtation, but that that affected the son and made him a genuinely piece of shit sex hound uh carouser uh and that and that there and the only character we should really be interested in is the grandson as to whether or not he i assume he's gonna find out that grandpa was never that much of a sex hound that's my you prediction sure? that's you what sure? i think that's what i think i don't, I don't know. know i don't know i don't know i'm just throwing it out there I, I, I will say having seen the first season oh yeah so so yeah i do know him from mythic quest he was the guy that had the 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 Pul- Pulsar I ain't never Award. Seen, I ain't never seen Mythic yeah. Quest. Oh, dude, Ma- Mythic Quest. It takes a while to grow, but once it gets you, it, it's pretty good. All I know is this: if you are watching White Lotus, don't bet against people fucking. <laughs> <laughs> all right, people fuck. People right. fuck on this show, my all man. Right. Well, right. <laughs> people be fucking. I mean, uh, that is one thing both episodes had in common is I got to see uh, uh, big man dong. Actually, balls mostly. Balls, the first time. yeah. Uh, uh, with with what I believe to my eyes, I ain't no scientist, but I'm pretty sure that was a vasectomy scar right in the middle of the balls, almost way back. But then realized that HBO Max would know that I was going back to inspect the balls of in that. Oh, was that Steve Zahn's balls? Yeah, in the first in the yeah, first. Yeah, because he was yeah, convinced they like, were bigger or whatever. Hey, look at my balls. No, yeah. like, I, I I found myself trying to remember where they poked a hole in me to give me the vasectomy, yeah. and I think that was the spot. Only real heads know. Oh, wait, real heads? Like people who pay attention. Oh, got it. That's okay. like a slang on the, uh, on the streets. Uh, I didn't know if like real heads were like R. fans R. of R.I.P. Takeoff. Real... Uh, uh, Takeoff? No, this is a serious thing. He's a rapper who got shot last night. So. Oh. R.I.P. Takeoff. Okay. All I right. was just talking about the streets. What no, are no, we no, doing? I, I, <laughs> I, I, just I, saying. I, I kind of like this game where you just stunt on me about all the things you know. I'm just saying <laughs> R.I.P. to a dead musician. It's fine. Uh, yeah, so I looked at balls, saw Big Dong, saw yeah. some butt crack, saw Aubrey Plaza checking out a butt crack and a dong. Yeah. She seems uptight. I have a feeling she's about to try being not uptight. I'm very excited for you to watch both of them. I'm very excited and, for you simultaneously. to watch... Uh, 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 yeah, mostly because like it is a very, very good show at uh, of walking that line, but not there. It's not soapy. Like think more indie drama from two thousand and four than like all my children. Because if it if it were like very soapy, then of course like the uptight prude would have a fling with the low status person to feel something. Blah blah blah. It would be like these gr- gigantic opposites attract stuff. Here, everybody kind of stays in their lane, but what changes is you find out little things that are underneath the surface that are motivating them. So there's this sideways glance that Silicon Valley guy gets from his wife when he decides to go upstairs with Aubrey Plaza, right? Yeah. And I, uh, we were talking about this on Cord Killers last night. Uh, do you think that's more like they're accustomed to, like they got a loosey goosey relationship, and she's annoyed that he's, you know, about to try to bang Aubrey Plaza, or is this part of a master plan to buy out or make a deal with former roommate? Uh, what? Smell that? Yeah. What smells like good writing? <laughs> 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 yes, which yeah. I'm trying to engage with. Yeah, no, I, I don't know, and and, and uh, I, I I could see it going other way. Like I get, like I'm I'm excited to see it unfold. Yeah. Uh, okay. What's up with corn? <laughs> the band? Yeah. <laughs> Where's monkey? 
<laughs> Where's Wait, monkey well, at? Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> Where's monkey from corn? Man, I just realized. Where's monkey from corn <laughs> is my question. I want to know. I got to put it on my desk by five, internet. Where's monkey from corn so, going? All the Where's he at? Who's he voting for, by the way? Is hey. he all the way for Newsom? <laughs> I assume they all still Look, live in I'm Bakersfield. Making, I'm making These are all the facts I know about corn. So I was about to say, I'm, I'm sad that um, I... Bat, 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 bat. That's what Jonathan Davis from Corn used to do in his songs. He was kind of like a scat man. Okay, question. What a brilliant, what a brilliant thing. I want to do industrial rock, but <laughs> I also scat. want to do just a little scat. <laughs> yeah. It would have been great if if Corn covered I'm the Scat Man. Uh well, I mean, he didn't really scat very much in Scat Man. Surprisingly little scat in the song I Am the Scat Man. Also, wait, wait, so, what, so what is the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's uh, scatting, right? Yeah, yeah, correct. Uh, what's that dude? He was in the Blues Brothers movie. Um, uh, uh, Dan Minnie, Aykroyd. Minnie, Minnie the Moocher. Yeah. Uh, John Belushi. Don't, don't you dare. Don't you, Donald Duck Dunn on uh, uh, some brass instrument. Um, God damn it. Not Scatman Carruthers. Uh, uh, somebody in the chat will have it. Scatman Carruthers. Cab Calloway. That's Cab what Calloway. it was. Cab Calloway. Yeah. 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 Like that's 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 good scat. That's scatting. That's scat. That's scat. That's, now that's what I call scat. <laughs> <laughs> Volume four. <laughs> Jeep jump and the cleave de doos. <laughs> <laughs> Coming in at number two. It's flip a dopper deep a dopper skibbity boo by Jack Black. Where do you think Jack Black is now? <laughs> like right now in the like world. Literally? Literally. If you had find my celebrity and you were just able to, to pinpoint exactly where Jack Black is, ignoring all the troubling repercussions that would come from sucking such a technology. From sucking such from a sucking From sucking that tech teat. But like... Uh, <laughs> But if you were to find it, where do you think you'd be? Uh, Probably I, L.A. I, I get the strong... In, in fact, actually, I I think about Jack Black when I... Wh what what just happened? I don't know. Oh. You're good. Keep going. Uh, oh, I they think about Jack Black. Every day, I don't get a haircut. And I think about his... Like, he's got a beard. He doesn't have a beard. He's clean cut. He's not yeah. clean cut. Uh, I think that... When you hit Jack Black status, you just get a haircut once a year, and it's for a roll. Yep. And then you just let everything grow out again. And, and then you're just famous. Yeah. Do we, do we know what... Uh... We don't. But I'm assuming this is being recorded locally. I assume that all this goes we're... into the board and gets recorded locally. We're frozen. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Continue. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, no, I aspire to... I, I, I would like to subscribe. You just have to be shooting more. Right. Well, like you, you shoot more often than Jack Black shoots, probably. Correct. But 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 like, but, do, but, you're, but, like, but you like, want to like, get like, to the point where you're shooting twice a year, yeah. and the rest of the time you look like an unmade bed. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm with you, man. That's that shit. I mean, now we're getting to the real meat of the Because what's the point? What's the point of being an artist if you can't look like a pile of shit every once in a while? <laughs> well, I may, uh, uh, on the flip side, like I wore a suit, and we'll talk about this in the show for for the Halloween outfit. Yeah. Uh, kind of dug wearing a suit, and kind of kind of dug the looks I was getting from my wife when I wore a suit. Uh, then I thought maybe I shouldn't wear mismatched shoes with blue jeans and a black T-shirt every day. Oh, hello. Well, your shoes match. Yeah. Okay. The yours not? Well, I, they don't match the rest of the outfit. I, I just bought the – they arrived yesterday. Uh, I thought about getting black shoes, uh, but then I thought, I don't know, I kind of liked how annoying that blue set was before, so I got the annoying blue set. I don't think that, that it doesn't match. Oh. With your with your outfit, that's very that's very kind of. Yeah, hey, you got blue jeans. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, less less blue the more I dig a trench. You've got blue eyes. Uh, uh, sure, let's pretend I do. You don't? No, I got like a moss green. Well, I'm not trying to flirt with you, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> moss, Jesus. moss green. Look at this guy trying to flirt with me. Over all here. right, all right. <laughs> uh, we, we got electricity. Apparently, I dug a hole deep enough that uh, that they into ran your a cable. new your new building. The, you the got workshop. a new building on the property. Yeah. 
It's a doon 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 doon. Built in 2022, the new building on the property represents prosperity and electricity. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. This is me doing the tour, right? Yeah, the, like 20 years from now when I'm hired to do the tour because I have no other talents. <laughs> this is this is gonna be my patter. So, uh, so Brett's here. Your whole bit. Hold on. Your yeah. whole bit is going to be to joylessly. <laughs> Like joylessly at that point all, all have been doing it for a while like and so people are gonna be really I, walk, you're walk, gonna look walk. like a piece of shit <laughs> because you're gonna be very rich I, because I'm, i now i'm only filming once every two years once every two so years so my hair gets so all the way down to my shoulders just like a pile of fucking <laughs> very expensive garbage right? and i <laughs> and i am uh, uh uh this bender that i'm on has ruined my life <laughs> like <laughs> everything has gone to shit <laughs> and so like like uh, uh, i'm now in your employ i'm getting paid Fucking vanishingly little, and I'm on a monorail, and I'm even doing right. my own music me because <laughs> nobody wants to tell me it sounds terrible. Well, and me, me, meanwhile, uh, we're bum, still bum, we're bum, still bum, playing bum, like we uh, before Brett becomes a bazillionaire. <laughs> we we managed to get one recording of him introducing "Welcome to" the yeah. various parts, and then you have to do the live announcement. So somebody yeah. I'll just get AI. You just turn my voice into AI. Yeah, he's gonna sell it. Yeah. Uh, well, oh, oh, okay, but but. But uh, part of the licensing deal is that Justin has to live for every tour, yeah. introduce everybody. So, so ah, they, they drive up and they get to the main gates. What do they hear? What does he go first? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You have to say like, "Welcome to the tour." Welcome to the tour. Okay. All right. Mm. You know what? I'm not paying you for that. No. But, but that. Should I not bum bum? Uh, yeah, actually. Yes, oh, I, I'm bum, dead bum, man, bum, at this bum, point. Bum. No, no, no! You're I fucking so rich. Dead, you're no, so I'm, rich. I'm, sorry, no. In in this scenario, I, I'm actually I'm getting a haircut <laughs> because no, oh, it's, it's because time for it's my time. one filming per yeah. two, two years. No, like here's what's <laughs> happening. You've built a gigantic tower. Like a tower that you need a plane to take it like to the top fact, of. I built I, I've also built a camouflage tower that I actually stay <laughs> yeah, at. That you think in. is just a larger tree. The rest yeah. of it is just Brian set up mannequins like in home alone <laughs> to make it look like he's doing things. But he has a secret tower. That's where you are, you're sleeping. So somebody walks up, uh uh, hi, uh, uh, my name is. Uh, uh, oh uh, no, this is a pre-organized tour. There's fucking thirty people. There's like a uh, part of a field trip. Yeah. A couple families. Yeah, they've all grown up on your content. Yeah, and they are they are here to see where it's made. Which which by the way, uh, I I can't increasingly. Uh, quick sidebar increasingly i can't get away from like there's this moment that people are like hey i just want you to know i'm like oh fucking don't say it and then they always say it i gr when i was a kid i, well, I wanted to do magic yep. and i watched yep. yes i'm old i'm old i did a thing Hello, you like old. Oh, okay all right all right yeah so anyway uh i'm i'm hiding and getting a yeah. haircut and someone shows up uh, uh, well, no, they, they get there, they get processed. Uh, tickets, <laughs> they get processed. Tickets, we, tickets we, please. We tickets, please. We delouse them. No. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, I don't know. It's your fucking facility. I don't know how fucking dystopian you want to take this. <laughs> I was just thinking that they get we, their tickets we, taken, we, but like we we get their passport because at some point I declared it sovereign property. That's right. <laughs> sure. Okay. That's yeah. Right. This is a troubling look inside your soul. Well, yeah, like, suddenly, uh, 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 yeah. So they get they get on the like they get on the on the tram. Yeah. Uh, uh, and I go, uh, uh, hi, it's me, Justin Young. Uh, no, <laughs> I'm not Jason Murphy. Uh, <laughs> let's go on the tour, shall we? Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. And I'm doing this for whatever, because again, <laughs> nobody's like, that's terrible. We can just play a thing. Like, I'm really no, insistent on it. Because I'm broken as a human right. being at this point. I only I have very few things that I can cling to for, for power, and right. that's it. And I'm, I'm like, very This is my job. This is the thing yeah. that I've got. And I look like shit for the record. Like I look like <laughs> fucking terrible. I look like like a, like a very sad baseball player in like the minor leagues sure like 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 the the guy who's holding on to a dream way longer than it needs to uh I, I, that was one of the things that bonnie said she loves about baseball is everybody's always happy is is that true are people always happy 
In the World Series, yes. Okay, yes. Okay. In the you rest see. of the 5,000 baseball right. games that Not they so play. Much. Yeah. You know, it is what it is. You yeah. got to find joy where you can. Uh, so anyway, we're going by... Uh, uh, bum, 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 bum. This is the soundstage. So many fantastic memories have been shot here, including... And now I'm naming episodes that you haven't shot yet. Uh, uh, including the bubblegum... Gatling gun, <laughs> the knife in the face, and of course, we all remember eating poison. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, um, uh, bum, 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 bum. And now you come in with uh, like, like now entering the other place, whatever, yeah. just say another place. Entering the van of destruction. <laughs> oh, ah, bum, 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 bum. <laughs> The van of destruction was invented when Brian went through a real, real hell of a time <laughs> and decided that vans were too pacifist. He needed to invent a van that really gave him, and I'll quote, what for? <laughs> and so, in this classic arc, he built a van that took over a country, this country, the country of the United States. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Now entering the baby fighting pits. <laughs> uh, bum, 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 bum. Yes, babies. <laughs> what are they good for? Absolutely nothing. But fighting, that's Brian's statement as he opened his episode I'm going to fight babies question mark and the out and the key art had him with his mouth open and four arrows pointing to a baby uh, of course he wasn't really talking about human babies but rather animatronic babies that were assembled by real children <laughs> Help me, help me, punch, punch, help me. <laughs> Why help do you me, keep punch, punching punch. me? Oh no. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. <laughs> now entering the re uh the refilling koi pond. Bum 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 bum. <laughs> this one's dumb. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Uh, all right, and then I jump out. Well, no, then, then of course it all comes like to to the like. There's like a moment where, especially this is a high value tour. You knew this beforehand. You were briefed that the Sultan of Brunei's side pieces, you know, uh, <laughs> not the Sultan. love child, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. whatever. Yeah, but there's enough important. money that sure, they paid sure, for the sure. special thing where it's like, uh, bum 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 bum. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that getting his morning paper? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see you there. And then I run. Uh... <laughs> 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 yep, there he goes, there go. running away from everybody, like he did in the classic episode. Oh no, my problems! <laughs> and then everybody gets bum 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 bum. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'd like to imagine everybody's handed like a, a, a dart gun, you know, with a tranquilizer. Yep. And, and they it, shoot each other the, <laughs> in the baby fighting pit. In the baby fighting and pit. now we'll go back to the baby fighting pit to see who the real rogue is. Oh. Anyway, that's my life. <laughs> yeah. We all need goals, Brian. Yeah. Uh, my, my life is um, I'm peeking out between the woods in my ghillie suit and I'm like, <laughs> Oh no, there's more of them. <laughs> <laughs> and I scurry around and I watch you deliver. And I was like, that was good. That was, uh, uh, I, I, good. Siri, remind Justin he did good. <laughs> oh, we're not speaking. Of this, uh, oh, no. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, we're not speaking. Yeah. <laughs> we're not speaking. Yeah. I've, I've gone into That's, a dark place. <laughs> yeah. Siri says, yeah. <laughs> Do you want, who is Justin? <laughs> no. I, don't, I, don't, I don't like anything about this. <laughs> This is all pre-recorded. No, too. you know yeah. Walt did the same thing. <laughs> he uh, would just hide in a ghillie suit off the he's still off, off, doing it off the corner he's of. Still doing of, it. But the fucked up thing he does it in Tomorrowland. So everyone's like, "Why is Swamp Thing in Tomorrowland?" <laughs> uh. Man, uh, speaking vaguely of of Swamp Thing, um, uh, I watched that uh, Werewolf by Night. Yeah, yeah on your recommendation, too. that's in the trailer. Man, yeah. things in the trailer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 love the animation on it. Yep. Shockingly similar to uh, Joyful, my dog. <laughs> like, like just just those big those big friendly eyes and whatnot. 
uh, I, I I must admit, for as many people recommended it, I thought that there would be more MCU integration than there was. But it was just a standalone, really cool, you yeah. know, retro horror story. It, it reminded me of uh, of uh, uh, ah, what's the Tarantino movie? The first Hooray movie. Hollywood, the movie, no, the, the the first Tarantino movie, Reservoir that, Dogs. Yeah, res, it reminded me of Reservoir Dogs, to where. They just dropped you in. Okay, okay, we're gonna just do this. It's like twelve year old said, "We're gonna put these people together and just do this thing." I have yeah, to but... imagine that the, that the script said, "In the room are Blade, Jessica Jones, <laughs> and David Bowie, <laughs> <laughs> and 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 knock off uh, 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 oh, what's his name from Portland." I thought it was more Marilyn Manson when he was in his Bowie phase. <laughs> yeah, okay. look, I'll buy yeah. it. Whatever it was. That's what, I don't want to quibble. Uh, they don't oh, call uh, me the quibbler did, for nothing. Did Did you see the preview for the the holiday special, the Guardians of the Galaxy ho- holiday special? No. I fucking love it. I I, I do. Like, oh my god! Is, no. is that James Gunn? Yes. Yeah. So that's but his no, last thing. No, no, no. He's doing Guardians three. Okay. Um, but uh, the, I do love that this is the first thing that he did after he came back. I believe he did this before they did okay. uh, uh, Guardians three. When, just just as a warm up. Out? Uh, <clears throat> Christmas this know. holiday season okay because uh, guess probably, what probably guess what? Thanksgiving night yeah. whatever people gather <laughs> around and uh, watch it okay first of all uh, I remember at m- one of my favorite bits of Werewolf by Night was the fact that they did a Marvel special and it was clearly inspired inspired by the old CBS yes. you know special yeah. thing yes. and uh, they play that at the beginning of the trailer nice and it's the Guardians saying oh Peter Quill seems really sad <laughs> because on Earth they're having something called Christmas we should get him something he really likes what's something he likes and they say Kevin Bacon. So they go and they kidnap Kevin Bacon. Uh, <laughs> that's the spoiler that's alert for the fucking trailer. Wow. But yeah, it's so uh, it good. Is, it is. It is like a a, a direct to video, super on its sleeve, nice. like eighties uh, uh, nice. feel good special with these characters. It's it's canon question mark. <laughs> like I mean, it, I, I love the fact that uh, it's much more interested in in having fun. Uh, which I was part- hoping that B. Arthur would be in it, just like other Life Day specials. Hey. We don't know. We don't know. Uh, uh, I'll tell you what. It was really transformative to see how good the uh, Michael Bolton Valentine's special was. Like, all of a sudden, I just believe everything can be that good. Well, no matter how yeah, silly but that's the premise is. a comedy is. special. Yes, and it was great. No, it's fucking amazing, is and my I, point. And, and, and I, I, you should not... like that. That is... The, the 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 frame of that was a comedy special about doing a dumb holiday special. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and uh, all I'm You're asking like, is that that's the line. <laughs> Everybody else, step on up. Yep. Uh, Can uh, you limbo that low? Is it is it too much to ask that everything be that good? Is what I'm asking. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Those were like generational talents in their prime, yeah, putting there's together certain, there's like certain things that I've watched that I went. You know, I I realized it was a bad idea to go. You know, this Lord of the Rings. Why can't they just do it like this all the time? This they were able to to yeah. do it, and it's like. By the way, oh. wait, 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 real quick to go back. Bryce, Bryce. Uh, did you see the Bash Brothers movie? I oh, I, I didn't know that, that. I did. I started it and didn't finish. It. Yeah, that that is like the last big Lonely Island thing. What what was the conceit? What about Palm Springs. You remember? Oh, well, that oh, was okay. Akiva Schaefer. Well, no, yeah, but this is like I'm talking about like music and, oh, oh, and yeah. them all together okay, and stuff I like that. Really like uh, the that the great. the conceit is that in the 1980s, in real life, Mark McGuire and Jose Canseco were on the same team <laughs> called the Oakland A's, and they were the Bash Brothers. And now the Lonely Island does a parody of their story. That's awesome. <laughs> and it's fucking ridiculous. And like, it doesn't, it, it vaguely tracks. Like there's like references to real shit that happened that like Jose Canseco dated fucking Madonna and they did steroids. Do, 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 yeah. They like, definitely like, do steroids. Oh, there's yeah. a lot of yeah. references to steroids. <laughs> yeah. A lot of references. Why to would steroids. I not? Uh, by the way, that. you said Mark, uh, Mark McGuire, right? Yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. What I heard was Mark McGrath, uh, from Sh- lead singer of sugar Ray. Yeah. <laughs> which, which that's the thing so that sli- happened in your head. Yeah. No, but, but ever so slightly, <laughs> I, I was, uh, contemplating he how that would play steroids. out. Yeah. So, yeah. 
<laughs> well, I'm going to hit the ball. <laughs> yeah. That classic sugar egg. Every uh, pitch there is a, a fastball down the center that I knock into the center field. <laughs> I run it out to first base, then I look to second, but I stop because it's not the right play. They're Baseball fundamentals. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> I would pay for a whole album <laughs> of you. Doing. No, you. Well, very yes, you would. Because yeah. you're very nice. Yeah. Oh, no, you, you, you would. Yes, you very would. Specific. No one else. Highest yeah. compliment. Yeah. <laughs> Not uh, even ironically. Not even once. Hi guys. Hey Bryce. Hey. Uh, what do you what, think? What's about news, it? man? Yeah. What do you think? What's about news? It? Have you seen uh, uh, the new thing on TikTok? The, a, they added a new feature to TikTok. Go the other on. Day, uh, where. So you know the text-to-speech thing that we joke about? Oh, right. yeah, yeah. you can make yeah. it talk anything. So they have a new Look filter. at Bryce explain the new TikTok things. <laughs> <laughs> Part one. Uh, so now they have a filter where when you record something on, on the app. <laughs> It'll make it into that voice? It will make it into that voice. Oh, that's oh, terrible. That. Can, like can, can we one? do it right yeah, now? God, I'm, I've got one. I already I'm, I made I'm one. I'm not happy about today. this he, at all. He, he preceded. I, I, uh, I made one earlier today. Uh, uh, do you guys remember? You, you may or may not remember the Nord scream, the infamous. Uh, wait, wait that was you? Yeah, I thought that was some kid. No, so this is uh, this is what it sounds like with the filter on. They did it, blue bastards! It's what they do. Damn you all, the heralds! They blew it up. Oh, well, they blow up. Net neutrality. <laughs> 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 I did so not good. know that was you. It picks up accents. <laughs> it picks up pitch. It is really. They have made. They have oh, made that no. Jesse voice say the N word a lot. <laughs> it, is, it is really, really man, powerful. Man, that's but, incredible. Yeah. The only. The only bummer is you have to. I think you have to record the video in your phone. You can yeah. upload it. I mean, to be honest, it's do. better because uh, you you clearly just uh, video <laughs> the screen, iPad. right, Bryce? Uh, I'm going to ask you a, a question, and I know I'm taking money out of our friendship bank to do it. Oh, okay. Can you please get the video of you stroking out on the show and put it through that filter by the end of tonight? Yes. Yes, but I'm going to have to get out of this green. What do we, we got, Tim? Uh, Thank you, Tim. Uh, we're going to see. We're going to play our own mini game called Was It Worth It? <laughs> So uh, <laughs> remind me of the original bit that, that we're translating. Uh, you will know the clip when you see it. Okay. Uh, it, would it, it would be better back, if I didn't? It was back. No, you'll know it. Okay. Because it, okay. Uh, uh, it was when we, before we moved here, yeah. I was still remote. Uh, and uh, uh, it was Bryce trying to set something up, but he just can't stop talking. And he just strokes out. And he's just like, Fox. You know, a <laughs> network that shows <laughs> pro pro programs and uh, and it just goes. I it trails. It trails <laughs> off, and then it just Fox News, and then it just me going, "What the fuck?" <laughs> I did not realize that it was that it was so notorious, both uh, to to you and Bryce. Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's not notorious to anybody else, but oh, uh, it definitely great. was on. I saw it because Bryce put it on the on 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 the great oh, night the great TikTok. night feed. Yeah, uh, and I was like, oh, that's a goodie. Hey, uh, reminder to everybody at home: make sure to clip things because it's easy to take clips from the show and make them into TikToks. Make them into talks. How's that been going? Uh, uh, well, uh, uh, hold on. I'm getting a call from Chairman G. Aha! <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. It's going great. Yeah. Uh, anyway. <laughs> What's what going on? Yeah. So, what look, are you wearing? Uh, uh, three is a great number of terms. Uh, maybe four, but let's talk about number five. Uh, who are you thinking? I'm thinking an American. An American... Me, mm -hmm. that's that's you to that's Chairman me to G. Chairman G. Yeah, it's funny when you said that. I was thinking of Mark McGrath God from it. Sugar yeah. Ray. Yes. Yeah, no, yeah, I, on steroids. Yeah, uh, uh, 
Uh, okay, I uh, that would be interesting. Uh, <laughs> you don't think he uh, ever juiced? <laughs> you don't think I mean, Mark McGrath ever juiced? I, uh, well, he 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 he's done some drugs, I assume. Yeah, um, but you don't think he ever fucking took some Winstrol in the ass? <laughs> <laughs> Is Winstrol a, a yeah steroid? yeah okay? Fucking get bulk, get, bulk up, but yeah. Uh, Bulk up for the rumble, you, slim down for mania. That's what they say. Yeah. Uh huh. Why? Why? <laughs> why would they say that? Uh, no, you want to taper the cycles. The cycle. Yeah, your your the, your steroid man- cycles. Yeah. 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 And uh, why? Why would you? Well, you're gonna be a be, you're gonna be a good brother. Shoot shoot a shoot a brother up with some Winstrol <laughs> in my ass, so I can bulk up. I gotta make the loop. Oh, the loop. Yeah. That's uh that would be when you We gotta make complete. these towns, dog. We're oh, in the territories. Your territory your Yeah, you're we're touring. we're both. Yeah, we're both in the territories. We're going back in time to the eighties. Yeah. You got any somas on you? Uh oh somas. Yeah. So many somas. Yeah. That was the fictional drug from Brave New World, wasn't it? No, it was also a real drug from the United States. <laughs> what, 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 did in it, the 80s. what did it what did it did it make you strong? It made you real sleepy. sleepy. <laughs> oh, okay. You yeah. go to sleep. Yeah. Well, because you know, when you're coked up. You, you gotta, gotta go to sleep gotta go at to some sleep. point, so you pop yeah. a couple somas. So that way, that way you can. You anyway, know. there's a lot of chitter chatters before you shoot this winstrol in my ass. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> I no longer. Uh, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Feel like anything I say is just gonna get cut off. Yep. <laughs> this is a new uh, new improv style called <laughs> Yep and. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. I was just trying to horse off. <laughs> I feel like I, I, I well, really got song, corralled. <laughs> yeah. I went a little too wild and free. Uh, Hopefully I don't get put in the glue factory. <laughs> who, who goes to the glue factory? Horsing, horsing off motherfuckers. Hey, part of but, yeah. but not, not horse boys. No, not them. They live forever. Yeah. I mean, until they stop paying. Then they die. Then they all die. Then they go to the glue factory. Yeah. 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 Attention, green room. Yeah. Yes. Would you like to see a clip? Why are yeah. you? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Please. 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 Yeah. Please. Can, can we see the before uh, well, and after? In the meantime, I'd like to welcome you guys. Oh wait, no, it didn't do it. Okay, hold on. Sorry. <laughs> Well, well, yeah. If you can play for us the original, well, uh, I would, I would love to. Yeah, Brian wants. To, Brian wants to remember. Uh. Okay, well then I will only have the original for you. Here it is. All right. Uh, well, in the meantime, I'd like to welcome you guys. To, you know, uh, uh, you know Fox, the, the cable uh, entertainment and, and, you know, family family na- you know network, right? Where you can see shows like... Uh, what's on Fox? What the fuck are you talking about? I'm just waiting for goddamn bit. You have gone like three months being like the secret weapon of this show. So the Fox with shows? You know, Fox <laughs> with uh, mm. shows, shows and uh, family. Yeah. And, I'm glad that uh, didn't work and now I have to listen to it a fourth time. <laughs> Oh, I think it's nah, funny that everybody's worry, just man. noticing his mustache. <laughs> I know, yeah. Oh my mustache. And my fat face. Oh. I had a fat face oh. and a big mustache. Hey, I, fa- I found, I'm looking for a mustache. I found your fat face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking to complete my set. That's my favorite C.B. Ray Vaughn song. <laughs> I'm looking for a mustache, but I found your fat face. I said I'm looking for your mustache, but I found your fat face. I'll let me grab on your whiskers and shake your jowls to space. To space. Yeah, he was in a sci-fi phase. Star yeah. Wars was really popular. Just for a minute. Yeah. Yeah. Prog rock. <laughs> Old rock. There's my pen. An eternity before the moon was born. <laughs> well, fat face and a mustache. Wish to the universe <laughs> into being. Behold, children, gather round, for we tell the tale. Ah, elder, elder, <laughs> tell me again about fat face and the mustache. <laughs> yes, it began with Uranus. Saturn, 
Neptune, Mercury, uh, Venus. Sure. Mars. Okay. Shut up. He's talking. <laughs> I'm undecided on Pluto. <laughs> and Earth, 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 Earth. Wow. Now bestow upon the Earth. Jeez. Monkeys. Wow. Now let them get married. That soon? <laughs> like there's now give them a consciousness. <laughs> what? Wait, so wait, marriage came before government? And now fire. Wow. What fire? It feels like fire. Yeah. Tanks. <laughs> Still okay, no government. Like, yeah. Democracy. Okay. Wow. Like now That's the first one? You felt like the... felt like retconning. Gunpowder. <laughs> no. That turns was, out, I, you can't, sorry, you I can't was, have democracy without gun. I think I, Elder's I was, having a stroke. <laughs> yeah. I, was, I, was playing, I was playing Sid Meier's Civilization. Oh, sorry. Oh, I see. <laughs> you know, sometimes you got to optimize. I gave him communism first. <laughs> Min maxing. You know. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> green room, green room. Uh, yes. Uh, we have a oh, clip. somebody called it. So Lon Makes called it. <laughs> like, are you playing Civilization? Uh, we've got a we've got the updated clip. Would you like to? All, All right, right. Here we go. ready. Okay. Uh, well, in the meantime, I'd like to welcome you guys. You know, uh, uh, you know Fox, the the cable uh, entertainment and then you know family family name you know network, right? Where you can see shows like. <laughs> Oh, uh, what's on fire? What the fuck are you talking about? I'm just like, you goddamn this. You have, on, you have gone like three it months being like the secret it. weapon of this show. It, it, it was, was worth it. it. You yeah, just blow this picture up, man. This suddenly, what TikTok happened? went from like the least relevant to, to the most guys, relevant thing in my life. Just now. There we go. I think we should hand it off. What oh. the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my God. Uh, all right, uh, all Mission right. Control, we're going to turn it back to you. All right, thank you to the green room, everybody. Welcome back, Yay. everybody. Let's do the great night pre-show, the green room, great room, a whole dang thing. I'm Bryce Castillo. Thank you so much for joining me here. Back again on the pre-part of the show. It's pre-scenes for prepare. And boy, howdy. Boy, howdy, are we prepared. Hello, everybody. Uh, it is November 1st, 2022. Bryce Castillo. We're going to go to uh, our Discord, discord.greatnight.tv, and we're going to go to the birthday corner, and we're going to find out who we are going to send some shout outs to here in the show. Thank you everybody for joining us here. We're going to go to the birthday corner, and let's see. Well, today's the 1st. So that would be everybody from the 25th. Okay, here we go. Uh, we've got boodly boodly boodly. We got Nick with the C letting us know that Len Peralta's birthday was on Friday. Happy birthday, Len. And that Waffleophagus's birthday is today. Happy birthday, Waffleophagus. Hope you're having a good one uh, as well. Hi, everybody. We are here uh, getting ready for the Great Night program. Uh, we got some stuff. We got some fun stuff for you today. We've got the Would You Rather Bot. We're going to play the Would You Rather Bot again. That's going to be a lot of fun. That'll be fun. We got some good stuff here. Um, oh, I'm going to knock that off because I did talk about that. Um, uh, 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 in the meantime, we got a little bit of time here. I uh, would like to talk just a little bit about the, uh, the, the Formula One Mexican Grand Prix. Um, just for a little bit because because good, good boy Howdy uh, was that a loser. <laughs> it was uh, it, it was an interest. It was interesting for a race in that like Mercedes were doing well. But uh, otherwise, it was just there was not a lot to it was not a lot to write home about. Um, there was it, it, it thought maybe Sergio would get uh, would, would maybe get his home win in Mexico, and um, ending up getting third was, was all right. It was interesting seeing the Mercedes. I, I love the memes. The memes all weekend long. Per, the Pirelli folks were saying like it's gonna be a two stop race. It's just two stop race. Don't try to do the hards. Don't try to manage it. Just come in for a second pit stop and just speed. And uh, at, at some point, the, the Mercedes folks said, oh, we'll put on the hard tires. Yeah, we could just run those. Uh, they're, they, they didn't get warmed up. 
<laughs> so they kept waiting. They were like, when, is, when are his medium tires going to fall off? And they just kept saying, our data says, our data says. Not good enough, though. Um, so it, I, I will say, the, 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 the cool thing about the Mexican Grand Prix is the podium that they have, where they've got... Last year, they just had the, the, the winning car and Max on it uh, raise up on the platform. But this time, they also had a little <laughs> elevator platforms for the second and third place uh, finishers, uh, which is great. I think that's pretty cool. I think it's very cool to just... There's just a certain amount of pomp. There's just a little bit of, of, of pomp in, in doing that. I don't know. I think it's neat. By the way, you can always support us over at patreon.com slash great night. That's a fantastic website to go do that. Hey, by the way, we, we mentioned this a little while ago, but uh, uh, we, we recently found out that our friends over at Patreon uh, uh, did everybody a favor. And uh, <laughs> if you had a pledge that was under a dollar, uh, they might have deleted your pledge. So, hey, check it out one more time. Patreon.com slash great night. Uh, just make sure if you're if you're thinking you're supporting us, uh, why don't you go double check that you're doing that? Hello, everybody. We got another 10 minutes or so. I finished a video game. I'm talking about video games. I finished a video game the other day. Uh, Ar Arcade Paradise. I've been talking about this a little bit. Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, Call I, it. I, 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 uh, hi. Uh, first time, long time. I thought there was no ending to this game. There's a story to it. So there's a point where the credits roll and then they just let you play forever. Um, at which point you wonder why you're still playing. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, it, it's kind of a bummer. It's kind of a bummer. They uh, You become everything that you hated <laughs> because you have run a successful video game or arcade game franchise. A, a little bit. <laughs> yep. A little bit because part of the story is... What like, is this game? What happens in this game? <laughs> That's I want to know. Don't worry about him. Hey, I'm <laughs> Brian Dead. He's, he's on I'm the I'm Brian <laughs> Dead. What the... Wow. What happens? What the hey happens in this game? Well, you, you, you run your family's laundromat. Uh, and you've kind of got this overbearing father who's out of the country. Go on, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear what's in this game. And laundromat, go. Laundromat, and over time, you build a little arcade in the back closet, mm -hmm. and you expand it out, and eventually you take over more and more of the laundromat until you just have so 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 the laundromat is the bad guy. Kinda. I think, I think it's <laughs> a sign of your malaise. But there's a, there's a certain amount of that too. Maybe promise. <laughs> the way that Eisenhower used to talk about it. It's a bummer because I thought I like Ike, Bruce. Oh. What about you? Well, uh, what are you a commie? Well, I kind of uh, you know I'm. A, anyway, what about this game? Anyway, the <laughs> uh, it's it's a little bit of a bummer because you're building the arcade and you can see you're kind of in like a rundown city and as you build up the arcade more, the buildings around you get niceified. They get gentrified a little bit. Yeah, but and that, and, and that gives that's a power. Sad, that's a sad thing for you. That that it, gives power to the uh, laundromat. It, it well, it's a. I just thought that they would talk about gentrification. I kind of was expecting there would be conflict in this game. Like, oh yeah, we're running an arcade in the '90s. This is not gonna run forever. Uh, and now I've lost this laundromat business that is like a service to the community, <laughs> but it doesn't do any of that. It's just like. Oh, yeah, no. Just so your big issue was the marginal utility of an arcade versus a laundromat. I think the story's which, not there. Which way, which one uh, uh, preserves the integrity of, of, of this this poor, this borough? Uh, uh, yeah. Longer. Yeah. A, a little bit. I thought there would be a little bit of that. What do you think brings more charm and culture to a neighborhood? Uh, uh, clean uh, whites clean or clothes. dance dance revolution. I'm gonna say clean clothes. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, but you think if everybody had shitty drawers, but they were really really good at Mortal Kombat, <laughs> that that didn't say something about about that neighborhood? I, I and you smell like shit. I, but I think, holy fuck, you can you can go from one to uh, to 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 uh, Chang Chung on Chang Liu Chung. Kang. Chang Chung, yeah. I am the dad character again because uh, I forgot yeah, the boss yeah. in Mortal Kombat. Uh, Goro gives it four thumbs up. He does. He had, oh. Yeah. All right. Shang Tsung. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Oops. 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 Yeah. Wait, I thought it was Shang. Shang. No, I'm thinking of Shang Chi. Shang Chi. Shang Chi. Shang Chi. Shang Chi. Yeah. Shang Chi. Uh. Anyway. Hey, it's Shang Chi. <laughs> 
So, so, so I, I don't know. It's, it's a bummer because I thought that there was a lot of potential that like there would be this really riveting story and come some conflict and yeah, some resolution and it was just kind of like, oh no, I, uh, I you became bought profitable. The- yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> That's- hey, wait a minute. Hold on. Wait. Sorry, no, no. Bryce, yeah, I don't want to run over this fucking segment. But like, <laughs> uh, real quick. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Do me a favor. I got a new character. Okay. All right. Ask. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to be Sean Connery. Ask okay. Sean Connery what his favorite MCU movie is. Uh, uh, hey, hey, Bryce. Yes. Uh, uh, listen, no big deal. Mm-hmm. Turns out I'm friends with Sean Connery. Oh, and... my God. Sean Connery? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. real one. Uh, oh. I, I think he's alive. Yeah. Mark, recently there's, there's, there's joke has oh, an no. expiration date. No, okay. <laughs> so just uh, do okay. it fast. All right. Hey, uh, what's your favorite MCU movie? Sean Chi. <laughs> it expired. It expired. We waited too long. Yeah, I, we I, waited I, too long. Yeah. It would have been funnier if it would have been immediate. Oh, I got a good. I got a good Sean, Sean Connery joke. Yeah. Uh, and what, now we're just doing this. No, it's good. It's a good <laughs> now joke. Now we're just doing this. What's I a, fucking ruin everything. No, what's up? What's I not, ruin everything. It's the best joke in the world. What time this is, is going it? in my fucking? <laughs> It's going on your permanent Justin record. Justin Connery. Yeah. Write down instead yeah, of, instead yeah. of difficult, they write down yeah. Sean Connery joke. Yeah. <laughs> What time? What time does uh, does does Sean Connery's train arrive for Wimbledon? What time? Tennis. Oh my <laughs> God! He just saved yeah. you by committing suicide. No, no, it's the no that was good though. I like that because it works two ways, right? It's tennis, tennis and it's tennis. Yeah. yeah. Rest in peace to a real one. Yeah. He it's- slapped women and, and <laughs> bragged about it to Barbara Walters of all people. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Maybe not. Maybe not so. You much want to pace. take a stand on that one, Bryce? Do you no. think it was good or bad? I don't really know. Slapping the... women. He no, no. said every oh. once in a while you have to slap a woman. You have to give them a slap. Yeah. Uh, I don't particularly Yay agree or with nay. that. I'm gonna give that a nay. Uh, next oh. on the hot seat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, yeah, man. What the fuck? Yeah. What the fuck? Sean Connery. He is dead though, right? Yeah, he he passed in 2022. He can't, he can't, or 2020. He can't hurt you anymore. <laughs> well, no, sometimes it's like, you know, you think somebody's dead and turns out they're alive. There's too oh, many yeah. people these days. Actually, it was, um, uh, he passed away on Halloween 2020. <laughs> he passed away almost two years ago. Exactly. I was going to say, it, it, I, I have memories of him, of, of processing him dying during the pandemic, during the lockdown. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I have memories right now of his ghost showing up and like, what time what, what, does what, the show what, start? What MCU movie do you think he'd watch? <laughs> you may think it's Shang-Chi, but it's Iron Man. <laughs> I like the elementals. I, uh, I like Tony Stark before he started treating women well. <laughs> I liked it when he was a real coos hound. <laughs> coos hound? Jesus. It's Sean Connery saying it. I'm, yeah. allowed. Uh, I'm allowed to say it if it's Sean Connery. <laughs> oh, oh! You're lighting would, the pumpkins. Would would you watch an entire series just about the abomination and his his weird sex cult uh, self help island? Uh, oh, yes, yes. Yeah. I would watch Tim Roth. I would watch Tim Roth do a lot of things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he's all like, uh, I'm "Glad we settled that because <laughs> that was really weighing on me." <laughs> I, I'm I'm Ira Roth IRA. No, what was his name? Yep, Tim Roth. Tim Roth. Tim Roth IRA. Tim Roth. Tim Roth IRA. Tim the Roth, Irish Republican IRA. Army. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. I bet he's gotten that the Tim Roth IRA joke a lot. Uh, right. That would be a very bad joke, and I think he's very successful. I don't think it's that bad. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not saying he gives the joke. I'm just saying, like as a kid, people. Probably no. The, when the, was the what? Roth IRA <laughs> yeah, created? This motherfucker. Yeah. Yep. Ba-da-da, ba-da-da, ba-da. Don't have an outlet for reporting, so I just torture my friends. <laughs> uh, can you guys vamp for another thirty seconds? Hey, uh, hey, yeah. Oh, look at <laughs> us! Hi, hey, you want to suck some fucking blood? Some We're fucking updating blood. the thing for a modern era. Anyway. Sucking and fucking. This is. What we do? Your eternal uh, paying with post-tax dollars is your yes, indeed. It compounds forever. I'm on Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs>
I'm vamping. <laughs> okay, thanks. It guys. all counts if I do this voice. Ooh. I don't know. Start counting. I think that's as obvious as Tim Roth IRA. <laughs> You asked me to fill, fucker. Oh, okay. Yeah, and um, <laughs> I'm regretting it. I'm, uh, hello, everybody. One more time, reminder, uh, patreon.com is the website where you can go and support this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> get, get our extra bonus podcast. That's an extra podcast every week, and it's great. Uh, oh. Get access to the Diamond Lounge in our Discord. Get email updates if you'd like it on RSS feed with no login. They make it super, super duper easy. Hey, everybody, you guys ready to do a Tuesday? Yeah, uh, let's do it. yeah. All right, let's do some final checks here. Uh, la, 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 la. All right, uh, uh, Brett, how are you feeling? Hello, sir. Oh, there we go. I didn't put it in front of the mic this time. Thank you very much. Justin, how about you? Yeah, yeah. Brian? Oh. Yes? Let's do this in the audience in the chat. Woo! All right, thank you everybody for joining us here on the Great Night, Great Room pre-show whole dang thing. Brett, I'm going to count you in. All right. 